Manchester United have agreed a deal to sign Mason Mount. And guess what, guys? Yeah, it's not a joke. Manchester United actually have agreed a deal to sign someone in June, not July, but in June, where everything was all crumbling down. We, everyone else was signing. We were thinking, when are my team going to sign? In fact, when are you going to sell the club? But Manchester United now finally have agreed to do it. And of course, I understand it is not the most overwhelming news. It, of course, some of you guys agree that it's probably underwhelming. But Manchester United have agreed a £60 million transfer fee for Mason Man after haggling, after free bids turned down. Manchester United himself had to just have a meeting with Chelsea. Chelsea. You know what? Man has had enough of you guys, bro. Hear me out, yeah? You're going to take the £60 million, pound, it's £55 million, pound, it's 50, and it's £5 million add-on, you know? Otherwise, I'm going to punch you in your face, you know? I'm going to slap you in your throat, yeah? And eventually, you know, Todd Baldy was like, you know what, man? Out here with Chelsea Taco Club, you know what? I'm going to give you the $60 million that you asked for. We'll take it, man. We'll take it. And yes, Todd Body accepted because they wanted a bit more than that. They wanted over 60 million. They wanted almost 80 million at one time. But Manchester United stood their ground and stood firm and said, you know what, you jabroni? You've taken the 60 million pound, my friend, and you ain't going to do nothing about it. Yeah, you're going to get your money. But you're going to get some of them in add-ons. And Manchester United have done that, you know? Big up to Fabrizio Romano who broke it up today as well for today's news. As always, guys. And remember, guys, for those who are new to the channel, remember to subscribe, first of all, to Reggie Knight TV. Smash that like button as well. Subscribe to Reggie Knight TV on Instagram. And, of course, subscribe to Reggie Knight TV on Twitter and Twitch as well. You know what the score is. But we are here to give you your latest Manchester United news of, for those who are new to this channel. And this is, a, of course, this is a Manchester United fan page, guys. But yes, let's go straight into it. We started off with today's breaking news coming from Fabrizio Romano himself. The tweet, as you can see that, guys, breaking news. Manchester United agreed 60 million package deal for Mason Mount with Chelsea. It's done. Here we go, guys. Personal terms agreed weeks ago to face-to-face -face talks between the clubs made it clear the agreement is done. Mount becoming a United player. They never left the race. They never left the race, of course. Manchester United never left the race. For Fabrizio, again, always tweeting, you know, it's always been nearly so close, you know, soon, and all that kind of stuff. That he's been between the same news, but the day he's got it right, you know, Manchester United never left the race for Mason Mount, despite reports that they never entered the race for Caicedo, so, which is which is probably piss off a lot of Manchester United fans because they probably wanted Caicedo, but it was only Mason Mount. Top target, deal done, 60 million fee add-ons include, included. United have not left the negotiation for Mason Mount. We was always in the heart, but of course, but not accepting the Chelsea 65 million counter-offer. Can you believe counter-offer? Door remains open, but Man United will not forever wait. They wanted that 65 million pounds, you know, and as you can see that they're MUFC as well. They got to Fabrizio. Man United have reached an agreement for £60 million. And of course, Fabrizio continues to go on and says, more details understand that Mason Mount will undergo medical with Manchester United of the weekend. Contract will be valid until June 2028. Five years deal agreed weeks ago. Fee £55 million, pound, as I was saying, you're on a fixed £5 million. I don't look at him in the new kit. Everyone's doing their graphics design. Again, people, we are so excited. The Twitter timeline right now that they, they're enjoying. But you know what? I'm not really that excited, but some of the fans are excited. And of course, you see that new teammates there. You saw that, guys. You saw the beef between Martinez and Matt when, when we did well against Chelsea. And now, can you believe that he'll be teammates with this guy right here, Martinez the Butcher? You know, where the Butcher will be protecting him as a teammate. He didn't like that there. He did not like that there. But of course, guys, you have to just say big up, big up to Manchester United for finally getting their first transfer window out of the way because, of course, we would have been fuming. We would have thought, you know what? Yeah, I'm really pissed off because you, man, should have agreed a deal for this long time ago. But imagine going throughout the whole summer and then finally signing Mason Mal, and you'll be thinking, you know what? Yeah, I've had enough of this, this club makes years. At least get this thing out of the way and look forward to the next transfer, you know? And of course, Mason Mount, we continue to indulge in him. BBC Simon Stones as well has said and spoke about okay, the article Mason Mount, what would the England midfielder bring to Manchester United? 
Wolves. They, he goes on and says that he's a top player, top lad. Mount's desire to sign to Manchester United is understandable. He, he, so he, here is an industrious, intelligent, creative midfielder entered his prime with wealth of Premier League and international experience under his belt. What is not to like? Digging deeper, only making the case more compelling since making his Blues debuts in 2019, following a successful loan in the Lebanon's with Vietis Aman and the championship side with Derby. He was under Frank Lampard's tutoring. Mason Mount has a mass of 195 appearances for Chelsea, scoring 33 goals. And I'll be honest with you, he has technically, in my opinion, been better, the best Chelsea player for the last couple of years, guys. Let's be real. And I'll be honest with you, he's been Chelsea's best player and for the last two, three years. And here we look at Mason Mount's stats. Again, look at him. One Champions League, one World Club Championship, one Super Cup. Um, I, can't, I don't know what trophy that one is. And I think probably that was in the Dutch League. I, I'm not too sure. Unless you hear. Okay, one English Youth League Winner Cup, one European Under-19 um, Champions as well. That's good for him. Of course, guys, we're bearing in mind that he refused to sign a contract in January. 35 appearances last season, three goals, six assists. But if you look at last season, where he had, I believe he had one of his best seasons under Chelsea. You look at 53 games, 13 goals, 16 assists, and four yellow cards. And the season before that, where I think where that's where he really started for Chelsea. So 54 games, nine goals, nine assists. So Mason Mount himself does bring something to the game, you know. Like, even though I am not happy in terms of all, oh, what I mean, I'm not ecstatic about it. I'm, I'm, no one's got a boner over it. Like, no one's got a hard on about it. But the thing is, he's a good midfielder. And he's a good addition to the squad in the midfield that we have, you know. And, I, and he should do well. And I'll be honest with you guys, I trust my manager. And if my manager wanted Mason Mount, and he wanted the club to get him. I'm gonna have to trust in that and believe in that, and hopefully hope for the best. Let's be honest with you guys. Hope for the best and hope that he can do something because at the end of the day, he puts on the shirt. He's a Manchester United player. You just you gotta back him. You really gotta back him. And there's what else can you do about it? Well, back your players. Just just hope that it goes well, and I hope it does. Him as a dynamite, I think he brings the dynamism in the midfield compared to Christian Eriksen. More energy. Probably can play a, a number 10 role where, where Bruno sits back and play a number 8 role. Maybe that might introduce the 4 3 3 guys. I, I don't know. But I want to know what you guys think of this transfer. Are you guys happy? Do you guys think, oh, we could do way better than that? You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying and you can do better. You know what I'm saying, guys? And you know what it is, man? It's, we, at least we've got our first signing. But guys, let me know what your thoughts on Mason Mount. Are you happy? Are you angry? You think, are you thinking, this is a disgrace? But you're happy to get it out of the way. He's a decent player. Let me know your thoughts in the comments as well. Smash that like button. Subscribe to Reggie Night TV. We'll give you more content, more short news like this. Again, once we break news all the time. As always, guys, remember to keep it united. And remember to keep it Reggie United. Your boy is out. Boom.